Okay, a few people have asked me how do I find more recent literature. So I just want to show you what I call reverse citation search, and other people might want to know it's different things, but bear with me and we'll take a look at this technique. This is a list of uh, my current literature. I uh, picked on one of these down here by a guy called Batsheesh, I think. I pronounced it right. Lesson to be learned from the Fairly of the UK University. Now, I, I haven't read that in a while. Um, it's 2006. So I want to know if there's anything more recent than that about this topic. Now, how better to find out about that than have a look at who's citing or referencing this work? And that's exactly what Google Scholar allows you to do. I can copy that text there. I can go into Google Scholar. type in that title, it will find the lessons to be learned, but of more importance to us at the moment is these citations down here. So we click on that, find something that's done recently, uh, like this one, you'll notice it's purple, that's because I've already been there, um, so we don't have too much of a blue Peter moment. I can now have a look and see where that's published, and see if the catalogue here at Edgehill has that. I see that it's in the Australian Journal of Educational Technology. Copy that. Go to our library catalogue here. See if we take that journal. Which we do. Okay, go to the journal. Now, you may guess it's in 25 2009, but just to show you where it's picking up one up from. 25 2009. It's here. 25, page 14. So if we go, 25, page 14, 25, page 14, is this one here. And then we can, I'll put it up as a HTML. And now we can read that particular text. And to be honest with you, I think I'm going to read that now because that looks really interesting. Okay, bye.